KXW faithful. You all should know me by now. The revolutionary, the villain, the deathmatch king, Adam Styles. I'm your television champion. And the last time everyone seen me was just a couple weeks ago at Rumble to Remember when I uh, destroyed, when I killed the dream of Christian Pain in holding his KXW television championship once again. But he ran into the buzzsaw known as Adam Styles. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, I am out here tonight to talk about one Maeve Deltzer. Someone that has been behind a device typing out his little words just as I do on some occasions talking shit saying things about myself and my comrades in the Lionheart Mafia Maeve Maeve When you called me out on Twitter to a match, I gave you a choice to either stand by what you said or take a step back, realize what you're doing, and take those words back but then our fearful general manager michael c ronan decided that hell adam styles has been fighting in all these hardcore matches and these damn death matches why don't we just throw him into another match with a nothing short of a weasel someone that lost a match and said that it was because of a flying fucking whale you're gonna put me adam styles against him <laughs> please you'd have better luck you, you you'd have better luck putting me in a match against fucking blaze kush or or fucking Danny Franchise, whatever the fuck his name is. Hell, you could put me against the jobber down the street and it would be a better match. Plus, what has Maeve done to even think about stepping in the ring with me? Hell, he lost to Adam Ace, what, three, four weeks ago? In his own match? <laughs> please, please spare me the laughter. Spare Maeve the pain and agony that he is going to feel after stepping in the ring with yours truly. But Maeve, after I'm finished beating the shit out of you, please, while you're sitting in your hospital bed drinking your applesauce through a straw, remember this. I didn't want to do this. You brought this upon yourself and if you want to point fingers at, any, at anyone start with yourself please Maeve and don't forget to point a finger at Michael C. Ronan because I did not want this match you did so I'm going to demonstrate for you Maeve what's going to happen to you when you fight me. You see this? This fine toothpick? That's that's all that's going to happen. There's nothing else. And then I'm going to walk out of the ring, walk to the back, get into my limousine with my comrades in LHM, and I'm going to drive off, and I'm going to go to the bar and pick up a couple chicks, maybe have a few drinks. And you're going to be carted off in a stretcher to the hospital 
where you're going to spend the next couple years, hell, I don't know, maybe the rest of your life sitting in there recovering from the beating that I'm going to give you. But it's all your fault, maybe. You asked for it. <clears throat> Anyways, I have bigger and much, much better things to do than sit here and talk to you bottom feeders out here in whatever the fuck city we're in. So I will see you all later.